Hey, welcome to World Code Updates. Please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for more updates. In a landmark moment, the Philippine Army has unveiled Project Cobra, a state-of-the-art fully homegrown remote weapon station. For the first time, the Armed Forces of the Philippines fields a sophisticated weapon system designed, developed, and manufactured entirely on home soil. This marks a powerful shift towards self-reliance, breaking decades of dependency on foreign military technology. Project Cobra is more than a technological victory. It's a statement of national pride and ingenuity. The system lets soldiers operate a heavy machine gun from inside an armored vehicle, using advanced controls, dramatically improving troop safety. The unveiling ceremony was filled with excitement as military leaders and engineers celebrated this historic achievement. For years, the Philippine military struggled with costly, restrictive international arms procurement. Project Cobra cuts through that red tape, offering a system tailored to the Army's unique needs and environment. This is just the beginning of a larger story, one of innovation, determination, and a vision for a stronger, more independent nation. As we explore Project Cobra, We'll see how Filipino ingenuity is reshaping the future of national defense. The atmosphere at the military camp was electric as top defense officials and engineers gathered for the official handover of the first Cobra RWS prototypes. The Army's Armor Division formally accepted the system, marking a pivotal step towards self-reliant defense. The event celebrated a successful public-private partnership between the Army and a local defense firm. Lead engineers, who dedicated years to the project, stood proudly as their creation was revealed. The Cobra RWS, mounted on a battle-worn M113, looked both modern and rugged, built for the realities of combat. Its 50 caliber machine gun was seamlessly integrated into a stabilized turret, showcasing Filipino engineering. The handover concluded with the symbolic transfer of the operational manual from engineer to commander, a powerful gesture of ownership. This act signified that the Army now controls not just the hardware, but the knowledge and future evolution of the system. Soldiers operating Cobra have a direct line to its creators, a strategic advantage foreign systems can't match. The ceremony wasn't just tradition. It was a celebration of Filipino capability and a new era for the nation's defense. At the heart of Project Cobra's success is its all-Filipino design and manufacture. Every critical component, from turret gears to targeting software, was created by Filipino engineers and developers. The team prioritized local materials and expertise, stimulating industries and proving the Philippines can compete in high-tech defense. The engineers designed a robust stabilization system for rough terrain and tropical conditions. The software, written in-house, processes camera data and controls the turret with an intuitive, tablet-based interface. Using a familiar gamepad-style controller, the system is easy for young soldiers to master, reducing training time. Features like digital zoom, thermal imaging, and auto-target tracking are all controlled with simple button presses. Local ownership means quick repairs and upgrades, no waiting for foreign parts or permissions. This technological sovereignty is a game-changer for the Philippine Army. After the ceremony, the Cobra RWS faced its ultimate test, a live-fire demonstration. An M113 equipped with Cobra rolled onto the range, the gunner safely inside, eyes on the tablet display. Targets at varying distances simulated enemy positions. First, the gunner locked onto a target 800 meters away and fired a precise burst, hitting dead center. Applause erupted. Cobra had proven its accuracy. Next, the vehicle fired on the move, the stabilization system keeping the crosshairs steady despite rough terrain. Again, rounds found their mark, proving Cobra's effectiveness while maneuvering. The final test rapid target engagement. Multiple targets appeared, and the gunner swiftly neutralized each one. The RWS's electric motors moved the heavy gun with speed and precision. In seconds, all threats were eliminated. 
The demonstration was a resounding success. Cobra was not just a prototype, but a combat-ready system. Project Cobra had arrived, ready for the battlefield. The Made in the Philippines label on Project Cobra is a strategic advantage, not just a point of pride. For decades, the military relied on foreign supply chains, facing delays and vulnerabilities when parts failed. Cobra breaks this cycle. Local design and manufacturing mean rapid repairs and high readiness. The Army owns the blueprints and software, allowing for quick upgrades and adaptation to new threats. If tactics change, Filipino developers can update the system instantly. Building Cobra at home creates high-tech jobs and keeps investment in the local economy. This project strengthens both the Army and the nation's technological base. Project Cobra is a force multiplier for the Philippines, on the battlefield and beyond. The true test of any weapon is how it serves the soldier. Traditionally, gunners were exposed in open turrets, vulnerable to enemy fire. Cobra changes everything, placing the operator safely inside the armored hull. This protection boosts survivability and confidence, letting gunners fight more effectively. The intuitive tablet and gamepad controls make operation second nature for today's soldiers. Training is faster, and under stress, actions are instinctive. High-definition cameras, thermal imaging, and a laser rangefinder give the gunner a decisive edge, day or night. The ballistic computer automatically adjusts aim for distance, increasing first-round hit probability. Cobra isn't just a gun, it's an integrated combat system that turns the gunner into a high-tech hunter. For Filipino soldiers, Cobra is a new best friend on the battlefield. Project Cobra is the result of years of research, development, and collaboration between the Army and local industry. The Army's R&D Center led the way, partnering with a pioneering Filipino defense company. Soldiers worked alongside engineers, providing real-world feedback to shape the system. Every feature was refined based on user input, ensuring Cobra met battlefield needs. The team overcame challenges, engineering rugged stabilization, writing secure code, and building a reliable local supply chain. National pride and shared purpose drove innovation at every step. This collaborative model is a blueprint for future defense projects. Project Cobra proves that investing in local talent delivers advanced, mission-ready technology. It's a testament to Filipino ingenuity and the power of public-private partnership. With the handover and live-fire test complete, Project Cobra enters rigorous field trials. The Army's Armor Division will test Cobra in real-world scenarios, across jungles, hills, and all weather conditions. Soldiers will provide feedback on durability, accuracy, and usability under stress. Data from these trials will guide final tweaks before full-scale production. The goal equip a significant portion of the Army's armored fleet with Cobra, boosting firepower and protection. Local production will create jobs and strengthen the defense industry. Cobra's modular design allows for future upgrades, advanced sensors, AI, or new weapons. The system could be adapted for Navy and Air Force platforms, creating a common defense solution. Project Cobra is just the first step in a new era of Filipino military innovation. Project Cobra is more than a weapon. It's a symbol of national self-reliance and innovation. Its success marks a turning point in Philippine military history and morale. Soldiers now trust equipment built by their own countrymen, deepening their connection to the nation. COBRA proves the Philippines can build world-class defense technology at home. This project lights the way for future local innovations, drones, vehicles, and more. It's created a new generation of skilled engineers and technicians. The roar of Cobra's machine gun signals a stronger, more secure Philippines. This is about building not just better weapons, but a prouder, safer future for all Filipinos.